the way the stamp project was designed uh, it was designed in such a way that to be set up two mobile ECT units of which we did we, we, one is in Kawe, one is in Mansa so how this mobile VCT fits in, uh, in the stamp project is that uh, we go actually to rural communities where we offer these VCT services to people in the communities and people are able to assess these VCT services where we integrate uh, the TB component in our mobile VCT. We cancel people for HIV AIDS at the same time people are able to we at the same time we screen people for TB. Uh, from the experience that I have uh, in this mobile VCT and uh, stamp, it's a uh, very very special in, the, in such a way that uh, us and the stamp project, we actually offer two services at, it, at once. The first service is HIV cancer and testing. The second service is TB screening. So under stamp we combine. TB, we combine TB screening and the HIV cancer and testing. Those clients who are found to be HIV positive, they are further screened for for TB. But when you look at the other mobile VCT services that are there in the country, they just offer mobile VCT, which is how which is HIV AIDS cancer only. The Moonlight video show is uh, an entertainment that is done in the night. We, we usually start around 17 or 16 somewhere there. We start by playing music so that we entice people to come. We usually play the local music, Colombian music, so that people can gather around where we are. And usually when it gets somewhere around 18 or 19, as it starts to get dark, we now open our, our projector, put our screen ready and we show a movie on HIV, TB or malaria. And through the sensitizations as they are watching the movies, we also do HIV counseling and TB screening in the tents. We electrify our tents and we do mobile visit in the tents and the other counselors also do the testing in the, the vehicle. And usually the numbers are good in the night because don't want to be seen to walk in the city tent during the day, but in the night that's an opportunity, that's the time you won't usually see an elderly man with us with a small girlfriend. I think uh, if you look at the integration of TB into Mobile VCT, to us as STAM project, it's a success. Um, TB and HIV should be treated as different. If you uh, look at uh, the origin of the disease, most of uh, our HIV clients, HIV positive clients, three quarters of them, they contain TB. So I don't think that the treating a TB and HIV defined to be ideal. Um, what I can propose is uh, we should continue, uh, or even after 2011 October, these services should go hand in hand because uh, when you identify someone who is positive, it is to treat TB because t as you know that TB is insecure, is treatable. So the best approach is that. Uh, should change the mindset of people. They shouldn't just focus on uh, HIV/AIDS alone. They should 
action also focus on the orphan TB services because it will be very easy to cure TB when you easily identify it through some analysis.